Good morning, YouTube. Today we are going to focus on binomial expansion through multiplication. Please like, comment, subscribe, and donate to my channel. My cash app is with the dollar sign up front, Fantastic Baseball. So, we observe here x plus y to the fourth power. x plus y is considered a binomial because there are two terms. The first term is x and the second term is y. So we notice there is a power of 4, so that means we have to write this binomial four times. x plus y times x plus y times x plus y times x plus y. So we're going to look at the first two portions of the binomials. So when we multiply, it's going to be outer, outer, and inner, inner. So this is going to give us x times x plus x times y plus y times x, or you can flip that around, say x times y, because multiplication is commutative in this situation, and then plus y times y. We'll put that in parentheses. And then we have the same set of binomial factors that are going to be multiplied. So once again, outer, outer, inner, inner. And then it's going to be a repeat of what we had when we multiplied the first two binomials. So x times x plus xy plus xy plus y times y. Okay, let's have this marinate here for a little bit. So x times x is x squared, and then x plus y, sorry, x times x plus xy plus xy plus y times y. Notice that the xy and xy are like terms, so I'm going to identify that there and put a 1 in front of that to show the hidden coefficient. So plus 1xy plus 1xy will become 2xy, so it's going to be plus 2xy and then plus y times y is y squared. Okay. And then the same will follow for the next set of mathematics here. So x squared plus 2xy after we put a 1 in front of the xy. and then plus y squared. So now we're in business here. So now we have two trinomials and let's multiply these factors out. So x squared plus 2xy plus y squared times x squared plus 2xy plus y squared. So it is going to be outer, outer, and outer. So, so so x squared 
times x squared plus x squared times 2xy plus x squared times y squared. Okay, that's the first set of multiplication there. And then we're going to take the 2xy and multiply it by x squared times 2xy plus y squared. So, plus 2xy times x squared plus 2xy times 2xy plus 2xy times y squared. Now we're going to take the third term in the first parentheses and multiply it by x squared plus 2xy plus y squared in the second set of parentheses. So plus y squared times x squared plus y squared times 2xy and then plus y squared times y squared. Now we are in business here. So let's have this marinate. So x squared times x squared becomes x to the fourth power plus x squared times 2xy. So we have a power of 2 for the x times another x here, which will give us x cubed. So it's going to be plus 2x cubed y plus x squared y squared plus 2xy times x squared. So it'll be 2 and then x times x squared will give us x cubed and then bring down the y. Okay. And then plus 2xy times 2xy and that'll give us 4x squared y squared. Plus 2xy times y squared, so that's going to give us 2xy cubed plus y squared x squared, or you can flip that around because multiplication is commutative in this situation, so x squared y squared, okay, plus y squared times 2xy will give us 2xy cubed and then plus y squared times y squared will be plus y to the fourth power. Okay, so let's have this marinate here. So Now, so x to the fourth plus 2x cubed y plus x squared y squared plus 2x cubed y plus 4x squared y squared plus 2xy cubed 
plus x squared y squared plus 2x y cubed plus y to the fourth. Just like we had on the previous side here. Okay. And let's have that marinate for a little bit there. Okay. Now, let's identify our like terms. So, we have x squared, y squared. We'll put a square there to identify that as a like term. And another thing here with x squared, y squared, with the 4 up front as a coefficient, we'll put a square there, and then x squared, y squared. And then we can put a 1 in front of that, just like in the in front of the other one as well, to identify like terms. And then we have... 2xy cubed, we have two of them, so let's identify these like terms as well, so we'll use a star, okay, and then we have 2x cubed y cubed, so let's use a triangle here to show the like terms and and there we go we are now able to work on the simplification process so bring down the x to the fourth plus 2x cubed y and there is another 2x cubed y so that gives us 4x cubed y plus 1x squared y squared, and then you have a 4x squared y squared, and another 1x squared y squared, and that will give us a total of 6x squared y squared, and then plus our next term of x cubed y Actually, we already took care of that. So now we have xy cubed, I should say. So it should be plus 4xy cubed. and then plus y to the fourth. Let's have that marinate there for a second. Perfect. So that is how we calculate Multiply x plus y to the fourth power. If you need math help, text five five nine seven four four three one six nine for services. Also, please donate on the Cash App to help support the channel. With the dollar sign up front, Fantastic Baseball. And I also have other 
options to make payments and donations that include Chime, Current, PayPal, and more. Thank you so much for watching this video, and let's learn math together.